Yeah. Name is KC. Yeah. I don't know how he did it. I need to see the video. Now this person's from Vegas too. It's the same guy as KC. Front lever check. Let's see what we got. It's feeling better. Let's give it a second. Really try it again. Doo, 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 doo. I'm looking to have another good like 30, 40 minute front lever session. Just hit the gym after, do some light cables just to get an additional pump. Still got my hair spiky from work. Meant to wash it off, but I don't think I'm gonna sweat. It's not even hot. Probably like 75, 76. Ugh. Oh. I mean, that was not the best form, but it felt like I held it for like a split second longer. It's so hard to measure the actual PRs of these static moves because they go they go in between your time and like how your form is as well. So you can have bad form but have really good time or you can have the most perfect form, but that, you know, it, it's a little bit harder. So it reduces the time. So. In order to measure these actual PRs, it's kind of difficult. <clears throat> but we're just going to run it as many times as we can. Really engage everything, protraction, into a solid front lever, baby. <sighs> that was all right. Got a good front lever. Then had to tuck it in, but it was more of like an advanced tuck. Still good. I think I'm going to run that. I don't know, about five to ten times. Until I really feel the fatigueness, and then I just want to go up a little band. See if I can run a little, do like a little power. Do some power runs. Last time it seemed like more of like, endurance runs but strictly training purposes oh you know what bro? that straddle feels solid let me hit a good straddle i think i gotta raise up the hips though engage the center area. I think I was dipped down. But I think the straddle might be the play. I mean, everybody, whenever I see it online, I see a, the, the, the main thing is like before the full plunge, you always see everybody doing the straddle plunge, right? Literally the step before. But I honestly never see anybody doing the straddle front lever. I don't ever see that. But you know what? Let's just run this straddle front lever. As soon as they get fatigued, we'll bring it into the advanced tuck. And then we'll do a pullover. Oh, that's a good one right there. Oh. That felt good. That felt good. I don't actually traditionally take pre-workout 
but I do treat coffee, caffeine the same way. No sugar, no creamer, straight off the pot. I know there's a big debate in the entire world. Like, is, co is coffee good for you? Is coffee bad for you? Man, I don't know. I just know... I just know I like coffee. Cheers. A little explosive throw on the top. That feels pretty cool. And I'm like right here. That's pretty good if you want to look. And just throw up enough. Throw up. Ugh. Can I say something different? Uh, push up. High enough to where you can clap underneath the leg and catch. Without smashing the knee on the bar. Ooh, I barely had to catch and be underneath the bar. Fuck, I need to breathe. Yeah, the breath. Damn, I already feel explosively tired. All right, move to the thin band. Who knows? Oh, it's pretty close to 10. Let's do one or two more. One more. One more regular body weight. Let's give it a solid go. Regular front lever to the straddle. Bring it into the tuck. Pull over. Exit. Na 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 na. All right. Saw the little run. All right, we've moved up a band. Let's do it. It's not much. This doesn't give much, but we might be able to hold for a tiny bit extra. Still, we're gonna work on the same thing. Pull, throttle, advance, tuck. No pull over because we got the band. Neutral grip. No false. Just a regular grip. Knuckles on top of the bar. Let's run that about nine more times. Just remember to move the neck. Get another one in. Oh. 
Oh. Man, it still feels so difficult. Just hit a bunch of little holds like that. Leading me, leading me down, down into the ground. Leading me. Crash and burn. I'm getting these different job offers. That's why I just got hired on the Red Rock. So I'll be at this park a lot more. Mm -hmm. All right, let's run it. No wasting time. Want to get this 30 minute session in literally as solid as possible. I'll give it a little bit of time. Matter of fact, we should have ran an EMOM. You know what? We're going to set an EMOM on. Let's set the EMOM. 20 minutes. Let's see what a 20 minute one feels like. So every time it beeps, every minute, I'll get into the hold. Hold it as long as I can. Ooh. Damn. I might try the this kind of front number with the band. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's open up the timer. What if I tuck it in from there? Oh. Oh. Yo, that's pretty good right there. Woo! Woo that honestly feels pretty good. Go from the full into like like a really advanced tuck. Still supplying the right kind of attention in the right kind of areas, though. Okay, back on it. Oh. Oh. Ba ba ba
Oh my goodness. I wonder if that would be a good set. Hit the thin band with this kind of style of front levering with uh and then go to a thicker band across the butt, really pull it in. Ooh. Trying to keep the back straight. Oh. I'm starting to feel a pump. Sheesh! Finish this 20 minute set. Finish the rest of the coffee. Thicken the band up. Call it a day. Oh, buddy. Where are you going? Oh, you know what we're going to play? Totally forgot. There's this good uh, trap station that I listen to, and there's this... Uh, Really good Halloween mix that they dropped. See if I can find it. It should be right here somewhere. Right after that. Oh, yeah, there it is. Two hours and 20 minutes long as well. Such a long trap mix. Precisely what a guy like me needs. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Oh my god. Damn. 
Dirty. Oh, another beautiful day. Temperature's cooling off. Back here at this fucking park. Family rainbow. I should be cursing. My bad. No cursing. Something I'm working on. Oh. I'm a huge trap fan for sure. Yeah, bro. Oh my god. Jeez. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Halfway. Halfway. Oh, the form is so hard to maintain. God. Sorry, we're doing good. Just remind ourselves. We're doing good. At least we're here. We're working on it. 
stay and focus on the goals. No matter how difficult or different it feels. Because this level of, or this style of training is, at least when you commit to it, it's way different from what I'm used to. You know what I mean? With the routines and the reps and sets and the numbers. Now I'm working on holds and times. Bring a different kind of strength to the body, you know? That's the goal. Oh. 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 We'll get there. All right. Mas. Oh my God, dude, come on. Can't go more than that. That's less than 10 seconds, bro. Ugh. Oh, <laughs> probably like eight seconds if I'm lucky. A little breeze coming through. Oh, that's a really cool van. Man, that thing looks like a tank. Halfway there, five more sets. I'm going to take advantage of Oh my god, that's so ridiculous, man. It's good, though.
Pampa Pimp and Boar, Land and Sent and Thor, Pink and Sent and Thor, ho ho ho. Dang. <laughs> Crazy. One more and we'll go up a band. Maybe we should just mess with the orange band. Go from yellow straight to the orange. I mean, I said I was going to do red, but is that really going to be, like, enough, you know, if I really just want to pump it all out? <sighs> oh, my goodness, bro. Let's finish out this whole minute. <sighs> Oh, come on, bro. Man, it's like I want to use the band to give me more resistance, but then it also makes it harder. Straight arms. Golly. What if we just pull tuck it? It's like kind of exhausting right here. Keep it advanced. Oh, there was the minute. Dang, bro. Yeah. Yeah, we'll just go to Naranja. We'll just hit the Naranja. Man, I do like that though. I do like that. That is good. I mean, it's it's so interesting how, like, without actually doing any actual reps, uh, you know, first off, my forearm, just from holding it, gets pumped. My arm, literally the whole thing gets a little pumped in it with the blood flowing through it. But the back is definitely the focus point for sure. Let's see what we can explode on, bro. Ooh, about to just fly. Oh, yeah, dude. We'll even go a little false, little knuckles, tiny bit over. Mm. Definitely just laying on it. Laying on it and it low key kind of hurts. Honestly, just run this right here nine times. Call it. I'm even going to throw these up a little bit. Yep. To increase the resistance. Maybe to get some more squeeze on top. Literally some like close touch holds. But we're not touching. Mm. 
I need to loosen this a little bit. We'll call that as a three. Number four. Number. Number four. Solid grip on top right here. Oh. Oh. We'll run it again quick. Where's my thing at? Where'd you go? Oh my goodness. Where'd you go, little guy? There you are. Bro, you just keep running away. Solid little back pump. Five, six, man. I need to get better with my numbers. Close grip. Six officially, four more. Call it. And we'll run the orange band. Why not? Right into it. Wide, too. Hit it wide. Make it a little bit harder. Thumbs neutrally on top. No, no false. Just for a hold. 
maybe a little pull. Oh. Ah. Three more? I think I said three more. We'll take this one wide. Wide for a hold. Dang, bro. We're, we're counting this. Still as three. We're in three still. Oh. Okay. Even with the orange, we're getting a little. Ah. Even with the orange, we're still getting a little fatigued at the very end. So we'll cut this time short in between. Hit two more. Cut that time short. It's been way too long. Uh, close grip. Close grip. Throw some of this on top or over. Slightly false gripped. All right, last one, last one, regular, least as much as possible, knuckles on top, <sighs> just hold this one, I'm just going to try to hold this one as long as I can, a little bit over. Bit more right there as long as I can the finale oh. Oh. come on get us together Oh, I still am just laying on it, but got to stop saying that. <laughs> All right. Oh, yeah. Nice and pumped. Front lever session. Number two, officially. Love you.